Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Mother 3. Okay, so we're here in the little technological portion of Porky's Empire Porky building. Let's see if we can avoid this guy here. I don't want to fight you. Ah, fine. Alright, let's head back up. I'll probably have to fight these two guys again. Yep, figured. Alright, so Lucas, Lucas could use a little bit of a heal here. Uh, life up gamma will work, because everyone else is pretty much fine, so... Alright, and now let's get going up here. And, uh, already... I don't know if I looked at that or not, but I don't think it's anything I need. Oh, crap! <laughs> Alright, that seemed like it took forever. <laughs> it would just never end. Alright, we can go up here, and there's sort of a new area up here. We can't really get much further than this little corner, but... This green liquid is the base component of the Nice Person Hot Spring. Soak in it until you're red in the face, and your personality will turn gentle and make you into a nice person who loves Master Porky. Oh, so this is how you're brainwashing everybody, huh? I can see some people over there. But can't quite get to them yet. Oh, no, not again. <sighs> Alright. Oh, come on, seriously? Alright, we're getting into a lot of battles in this video, it seems. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna deal with that because that present is probably nothing I want. So we can go over here and we're actually gonna get out of this area pretty soon. Welcome, this is the nice person Hot Spring. Using this will make you into a nice person who respects Master Porky from the bottom of your heart. Use it until you're red in the face and you'll feel happy and revitalized as a nice person. Unlike with regular Hot Springs, all you have to do is go inside a green colored capsule, which makes it very simple and convenient. I think a regular one's probably simpler. And I'm already a nice person, what are you talking about? This green liquid shines ominously. Yeah, seriously. Alright, and we can actually talk to pretty much everybody that's on the front row here. There's a sheep. Thank you, Mr. Porky. Some chickens. Just the idea that a chicken like me can be useful to Max Porky in some way makes me oh so happy. Someday I'm going to become a pig mask and make the world of Master Porky by Master Porky for Master Porky. Okay. This feels so nice. I'm sure it does. We can also talk to people down here. Let's sing. Let's sing a song praising Master Porky. Yeah, so as you can tell, these guys have been just totally and completely converted. <laughs> I feel sick. I should have gotten in here. Yeah, t tell me about it. Let's have a grand old time. Master Porky's City of Memories. Pig here. Reconstructed with a lion. So happy. Ugh, that'd, be, that'd be weird. Reconstruct animals. Make ferocious. Yep, so I'm not going to talk to all these guys. I, love, I like the cow, though. I'm going to be a wonderful steak for Master Porky. <laughs> and then, of course, there are even more if you wanted to talk to all these, but I don't know. I mean, that just seems like a lot of time to me. Your attention, please. You appear quite exhausted there, Lucas, but the real fun is just about to begin. All right, climb up those stairs just ahead. Come on, don't disappoint me now. <laughs> Alright, and of course there's a frog here, which we can actually use to save, if you want. But... Oh, I see. Well, please be careful out there. Give me a rush to the next frog you meet. So I guess, I don't know, you can't brainwash a frog or something. That beats me. Alright, so we are now climbing the stairs, and we're getting very, very close to the uh, end of the Empire Porky building here. Uh, we're actually going to be doing a few interesting things here. Lucas's fever went away and learned Healing Omega. Um, I'm not sure, I'm not good, what the difference is between Helico Omega and the rest. Oh yeah, cure all ally status ailments. So, yeah, that can be pretty helpful as well. It's a pretty good little spell to pick up. Master Lucas and friends, I have been waiting for you. I've changed my hat, so perhaps you don't recognize me, but I was the chauffeur of that difficult to drive and far too long limousine. I'm pleased to see that you've made it this far. I will now determine if you're fit to meet with Master Porky or not. Kindly follow me if you would. Alright, and we actually can uh, get a little hint about what we need to be doing here. As you can see, this place is pretty crazy. Uh, we can talk to this chick over here. This is written... I guess it's a chick. I don't know. It looks like a chick to me. I just think it is. This is written on the cue card. Laugh, laugh. Ha, 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 ha. Okay. Uh, I guess she doesn't give you the hint yet. She gives it to you afterwards, I know, but... Master Porky just loves to play fun games, so I will use this super whack-a-mole game to judge whether or not you're fit to be a wonderful playmate of his. First, allow me to explain the wonderful rules. Whoever hits the most moles with their mental A button hammers will win the game. Master Porky absolutely adores that word, win. If the words indulge and humor mean anything to you, you'll know what to do. But if you try to throw the match, Master Porky will be very displeased indeed. Okay, do you understand the rules now? Sure do. Hit the old guy in the helmet and you'll be zapped. Do try to be careful. Now then, let's bring out Master Lucas's competitor, Master Mini Porky. Mini Porky. Whoa, holy crap, it's a little robot with a siren on its head. Okay. <laughs> Aw, he's kind of adorable, isn't he? Ready, Master Mini Porky? Begin! 
Alright, so now Porky's gonna, or Mini Porky here, is gonna play the game and kind of show us what's going on. Uh, don't worry, you're not gonna have to sit through the entire game. It actually takes quite a while. Because after a couple moles, the screen fades out and we can just get to hear his results. Wow, simply amazing. You hit a grand total of 10 moles. Alright, you're up, Master Lucas. Okay, and as the guy said, if the words indulge and humor mean anything to you, then uh, do that. Basically, since he hit 10 moles, we need to lose to him, but just barely. Um, oh crap, I've completely lost count. Oh my gosh. Uh, I think this is nine. I'm gonna go for it, but uh, anyway, like he hit ten moles, so basically what you need to do is hit nine in order to lose just barely. I completely lost count there. I'm sure you guys are probably screaming at me. No, you didn't hit enough, or you hit too many, or something. But we'll find out. If you lose, all you have to do is do it again. So it's no big deal, really. All right, for the results, let's see. I'm sure I got that wrong. Ta-da! Nine! Oh my gosh, I hit it exactly right. That's awesome. Oh my, Master Mini Porky, you've won the intense match by the razor-thin margin of one mole. What a wonderful game! Truly heart-stopping. Now then, let's move on to the next fun and exciting game. Yep, so basically that's the idea. We're going to be playing a couple games with this guy, and um, we need to lose just barely. And if we talk to the cue card person here, hit nine to lose just barely. So there's the little clue I was talking about. I figured that I'd give it to you beforehand, but I guess not. Okay, so now we can make our way up the stairs once again. I kind of like these little stair sections, I don't know. Alright, things are really heating up now. Yeah, now this one I'm not really a big fan of, but hopefully we'll be able to do it. So as you can see, there's a long, like, pink beam over there to a finish line at the end, where the host is. Next is the Purple Bridge Race Game. You'll both start from a purple bridge at the same time, and the first to reach the other side wins. You understand the rules, yes? Also, if you have the two words indulge and divulge, perhaps the former would be the one to focus on if you catch my drift. Do you understand? Yeah. We need to lose just barely, I get it. Okay, when you're ready, go to your starting position. Let's talk to the cue card person first. Your fly is open, XYZ. Uh oh, holy crap. <laughs> Fix that real quick. You're much manlier now. Alright, totally. <laughs> okay. Is this really what we should be doing? I don't know why, this seems really stupid. Yeah, it does seem really stupid, doesn't it? Alright, so let's get on the starting line here. Alright, on your mark, get set, go! It's when you start, okay? Alright, on your mark, get set, go! Alright, now we really go. And we can basically just run all the way over here. I mean, we can obviously beat him. But what we need to do is just kind of wait right next to the finish line until he's about to cross. And uh, this can be really difficult. I'm not sure how big the margin is, like for how close you need to be. But uh, I personally have never failed it, so... Hopefully we can do okay here. I don't want to have to sit here like this again. There we go. Yeah, it's really hard to figure out because he kind of like hesitates and slowly goes over the line. You know, it's really annoying, but... Uh, thankfully, we got it on the first try, so that's good. Alright, so now we can move on to the next game which is also the final one, not to ruin anything, but... At last, we're at the final game. Please come this way if you would. Yeah, see, he says it right there anyway, so... The final game is, to whom goes the boom? Alright, here's a quick explanation of the rules. Use your mental A button, air pump, to quickly inflate your balloon until, boom! The first to pop his balloon wins. You understand the rules now, right? I sure do. Please go to your position. What do you have to say this time? Your fly isn't open. Don't worry about it. Okay, good. Let's see if they say anything different. So this is the final indulgence, huh? The fact that this Porky guy is forcing us to do all this stuff makes me feel like he's a lot stupider and pettier than we thought. I, I like Buster's outlook on this. I really do. Now then, I'm tripling the points for this final game. That means you have a very good chance of coming from behind to win it all, Master Lucas. Please try your very best. But don't. We still need to lose, just barely. Okay, so what we need to do is blow the balloon up until it's about ready to pop. Uh, that's as big as it gets, I believe. Oh, no, one more. Okay, there we go. <laughs> it went up four. I thought it only went up three, but... Yeah, you just need to make sure the balloon is at its biggest state without popping uh, before he does, so... You're so young, yet you've mastered so much. I hereby deem you fit to meet Master Porky. 
Now then, please go and pay Master Porky a wonderful visit. Okay, so are we finally gonna get to see this guy now? Can we check these balloons? Oh, no, no, it's like floating, okay. Alright, so now we have one last stair section, and as you can see, there's a sofa here that we can rest on, so... Uh, and also a save frog, so that should be pretty indicative of what's coming up next. Alright, so we are fully recovered from the sofa, and now we can go up here through this door, and... Whoa, holy crap, what is this thing? Lucas, welcome to my room. This is the real 100th floor that you've wanted to come to oh so badly. Again, I welcome you, my beloved detestable pests. I was the one who invited you here, so you're free to come inside if you wish. It's just I've given orders to let no one enter my room to that little attack toy you see right there. Who knows, maybe this is where we'll say goodbye even though I invited you here. Alright, let's turn it on. Say hello to the natural killer cyborg. Alright, so, I, this is like the third time I've done this now, but I'm going to have to leave you guys off uh, with a little cliffhanger here with the natural killer cyborg. Uh, pretty cool boss battle, but I don't have time to get it all in right now, which is why I'm doing this. Uh, I'm not just an evil person, I promise. <laughs> Alright, so in the next part, it looks like we're going to fight the natural killer cyborg in order to gain entry into Porky's room. So until then, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next time.